There you are. I can take you in to see the kings when you're ready. What do I need to know before I go in? Ah, that's right. You've never had an audience with the two kings. I've met Pausanias. King Papsanias. Ah, really? Kings Papsanias and Archidamos share rulership. Impress them both, and your home will be returned to you. I didn't expect this to be pleasant. What can you tell me about Pasanias? He's young. Don't mistake his smile for kindness. As with all kings, those who cross him learn to regret it. What should I know about Archidamos? Archidamos is a traditionalist. Not one to back down from a fight. He's also got a temper. Try to stay on his good side. Waiting won't make this easier. Then let's go. Your mother's already inside. Another two squadrons to Vietir, then, as I said. Is that how they solve arguments? Sometimes. Archidamos's guard has improved. He should thank me. Prasidas, you've come with news. Let's hear it. My kings, may I present Merini, descendant of Leonidas and her son Alexios. How dare you show your face in Sparta? Alexios helped me secure Corinthia, my king. He helped with the Ilotes rebellion. They want what's best for Sparta. I beg you to listen. Let's hear what they have to say before we bloody the palace floor. Speak, Marini. Why are you here? I have returned to reclaim my Spartan citizenship. To reclaim our home. You exiled yourself. Your son killed an elder and ran. Not to mention the crooked nose he gave you. My family was betrayed, my king. Sparta was betrayed. We've come to expose these traitors. <laughs> you haven't cared for Sparta for many years. Your elders had both her children thrown off a cliff. They tore our whole family apart. Alexios, not here. But the minute she thought Sparta was in danger, she came back. She brought us both back to help. How dare you accuse her of not caring? I've heard your grandfather couldn't control his temper either. Marini has made her intentions known. What are yours? My intentions are to hunt down those who betrayed my family and Sparta and kill them. And who exactly do you think betrayed Sparta? That's what I'm here to find out. First, Prove yourself loyal. Bring glory to Sparta, and redeem yourself in the eyes of the gods. Until then, neither you 
nor your mother have a right to your lands. Tell me what I must do, and it will be done. The Spartan army fights the Athenians in Theotia. Join the commanders there. Come back victorious, or do not return. Consider the battle won. Spoken with the confidence of a child who hasn't seen real war. You will find my commander out of Mount Helicon. Give him this and tell him I sent you. Not so fast. Two kings, two tasks. Heracles completed twelve. Two shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> First Spartan thing you've said all day. The Olympics will be starting soon in Elise. And our fighting champion requires an escort. You want me to be an escort? I want you to make sure the Spartans return with a wreath. <coughs> That's how he'll bring glory to Sparta? By winning an event in the Olympics? Not an event, my king. By making sure Sparta wins the entire Olympics. <sighs> Perfect. You have your orders. We'll see you when your tasks are completed. If they're completed. I'll get them done. And you'll give us back our home. There's some Spartan left in you after all. Brasidas. Show them out. Next! That went well. Considering you still have your head on your shoulders, yes, I'd say it went very well. The kings were generous to give us a second chance. And all I have to do is win the Olympics. And a war. Is there anything you need to know before setting off? What's going on in Viotia? The Athenian army is pushing Sparta back bit by bit. Winning won't be easy. If anyone can turn the tide there, it's you. What do you know about this fighting champion I'm supposed to take to the Olympics? The Pankratian fighter. His trainer will know where he is. My thanks. Things are not quite what they seem. But you must keep this champion safe at all costs to succeed. I will. One of the kings is a cultist. So, one of these tasks is surely a trap. But... which one? Brasidas? Wouldn't say that within earshot of the palace. But I fought with both of them. I can't believe either is a traitor. We need to find proof before we make any accusations. Keep your eyes open. I think I'm ready. And you? What will you do while I'm gone? I received a message just before we went in. What kind of message? A clue to the whereabouts of another cultist. I'm going to Arcadia. Alone? The fates are smiling on us. I was ordered there. We can travel together. That would be helpful. My thanks. I'll meet you both in Arcadia then. Safe journeys.
you later. Looking for... You! Stentor? Oh. Oh. Malakas! I'm here to help, you idiot! Not after Megaris! Not after what you did! King Archidomos of Sparta sent me to aid you in securing the region. This is how much he trusts me. He put his faith in a fucking mercenary! The gods are punishing me with your presence. If I was your punishment, you'd already be dead. Why have the king sent you? I missed my new brother so much that when Archidomo sent me here, I jumped at the chance. Malaka! The wolf would have ended the war if it weren't for you. Your help will bring nothing but misery. I'm here on business. What's going on? Everything is fine. The Viodian rebels are a problem, but nothing we can't handle. What is the Spartan army doing in Viotia? We sieged Athens, but Cleon took power and pushed us out. The King Viodia will weaken his position. The wolf was gone. I was needed. I couldn't abandon my men. 
You should thank the gods that I've come to help you. The only reason you're still alive is that the writ you carry. You're not an ally, just a weapon. Then put me to work. You're not up to the challenge. Try me. There are four Viodian champions fighting for the Athenians. Aristeos, Yanira, Nesea, and Veragon. Think you can kill them? I'd like to see you try. I told you we could work this out. All right, then. I'll find these champions and put an end to them. I doubt it will be as easy as you think. But I'm relieved to see you can follow orders. Where will I find these mighty Viotians? I only know of two. There are reports of Aristeos occupying the military fort of Gela. Nesea was last seen in the forest east of Thebes. I thought the Viotians hated everyone. Why are they working with Athens? They see both Sparta and Athens as enemies. But Athens got here first, and they agreed to a temporary alliance. What's so great about these champions? They're just four people against the Spartan military. Sparta has its army, and Viodia has its legends. And they're a symbol of what this place used to be. The sooner I get this done, the sooner we take Viotia for Sparta.
that he is. Looks like I missed a fight. Aristeos found you. The watch will be vigilant here.
This is it. These tracks don't look human. They lead away from the camp to the north. This fire's fresh, and the food's still simmering. They say I can't be far away. This hut must be Nesea's. I guess she prefers the quiet of the forest over living in the city. There stalks the mighty hunter. This area will be well defended.
When did this happen? Thank the gods you're here. A hunting party has been attacked outside the city, near the cursed land of Oedipus. Any survivors? This man saw dead bodies, but he could still hear screaming. There are many dangerous beasts out in the wild. If someone is injured, they won't last long. I need you to go and rescue whoever is still alive, and put an end to the dangerous beast that attacked them. All right, I'll destroy the beast and see if anyone's still in one piece. If they are, bring them back to me, and I'll do what I can to save them. There are a lot of hunting grounds nearby. Where should I look? They were sighted following animal tracks around Snakehead Rock. Do you know what attacked them? Not for certain. The roar could have been from any number of beasts. Many predators call the wilds of Viotia their home. How many people will I find out there? It sounded like only one hunter was left alive, but hunting parties usually contain three or four people. I'll go and find the trail. Must be what's left of the hunting party. Let's move! I need to get him back to Hippocrates before he bleeds out all over me. Deviants. Cowards that surrender to Xerxes.
Maratón observa. When did this happen? Earlier today. I was taking a boy fishing when we heard the screams. What were they doing out there? <laughs> How's the patient? He'll survive if I treat his injuries. If? This man is a monster. He's a slave trader who treats people so terribly that they injure themselves just to avoid working for him. <sighs> if I help him, he'll continue to hurt others. But if I choose to do nothing, many will be spared pain and suffering. It shouldn't matter what this man has done. He deserves to be treated like anyone else. We can't judge others when they're at our mercy. I know it's my duty to help this man, but if you'd seen some of the injuries I've treated that he's caused, you would understand my doubts. The innocents of the Greek world have suffered enough lately. What if I free his slaves? If he has no slaves, he can't mistreat them anymore. And you'll be able to treat him without guilt. Yes. I can save this man. And you can prevent him from hurting others. Our kindness here will show him the error of his ways, show him a different path to walk. You would do this for me? Of course I'll free the slaves for you. Thank you, my friend. Where are these slaves being held? I remember paying a visit to a camp on the riverbank east of Lake Cobais to treat a slave for self-inflicted injuries. I'd try there. Are hunting parties often attacked this close to the city? It's quite unusual, but with the war raging all around us, and the plague consuming everything else, it's no surprise the beasts are becoming more desperate. If the slaves are in danger, I will need to hurry. I see him. I need to talk to her. I need to stay hidden.
You have offered me freedom. Thank you for your kindness.
thank you for freeing us. That beast Galeos has worked us all to the brink of death. Now I can return home to my family. I freed the slaves. I've treated his injuries enough to stabilize him, but he isn't out of danger yet. I don't know if I can bring myself to complete the treatment. So you're just going to stand here and watch this man die? You need to do what you do best and heal him. It's what the gods put you here to do. Help people, not judge them. If I do nothing, I'll be no better than him. I'll make sure he recovers. When he does, be sure to tell him how his life was in our hands. Only the gods have the power to decide life and death. What I do is insignificant compared to their benevolence. I've seen you save many from a trip down the Styx. But look at the plague. For all my knowledge and experience, I could do nothing against it. I have to accept that my reach only goes so far. Thank you for your help, my friend. I must go. I have an appointment with a patient elsewhere.
You there, come here. What is it? So Merc, calling himself the Eel Bearer, came to Alpolos, offering to help out. Nice kid, and I've heard his name before. I thought to myself, make at least that track me well spent. I don't know who's been using my name, but you're going to tell me everything you know. What is there to tell? He came in, had some little bird with him. You know how legends go. One day he gets a bird, next he's called the Child of Zeus. But I do have an eagle. I see that now, don't I? But I paid this other eagle bearer a small fortune to get the villagers ready for a pirate invasion. By the look on your face, I'm guessing that didn't work out. It didn't. Then I sent him to bargain peace, but he botched that too. The pirates are coming, and we don't stand a chance. Next time, hire the real eagle bearer. But I'm listening. Does the village of Alponos have a militia? Not enough. But if you get out there and stop the pirates before they land, I'll give you all that's left in the treasury. I'll stop the pirates from reaching your shore. Then you're going to help me find this eagle bearer imposter. I'll help you kill him myself. Where are the pirates sailing from? We saw the pirate fleet forming north of here. How big is their fleet? Just two ships, but they may have hundreds aboard. They make it to us. We're dead. Time to show the pirates what the real Eagle Bearer can do. Hope you can swim, pirate scum! That's how the real Eagle Bearer deals with pirates! Got to be careful not to get spotted. Ready to set sail! Awaiting your orders, Commander!
Head for open water. Keep up the speed! We are going as fast as we can, Commander! Faster! Full power! Commanders, let the hell! You're released! <laughs> It's our Poseidon's problem now. What have you done? Didn't you hear me screaming? You sunk our reinforcements! You didn't say anything about reinforcements. You said pirates. Oh. I sent a message to the supply ships to disguise their sails. Look like a pirate and sail in unseen. Those ships had supplies and troops. You're not an actual general, are you? N not... Uh, uh, listen to me, Mistios. I fought in three wars. No training prepares you for this. You had no strategy. <sighs> These villagers are as good as slaughtered because of you. But if we can get them ready, they can fight off the pirates themselves. I'll do it. I don't see an armory, though. Where is the smith? He hasn't worked since the last eagle bearer was here. I'll get him making swords. Can the villagers ride? For salt workers, they're not bad. And there's a horse breeder in town. I'll talk to them. Though we can't just arm them and tell them to fight. There's only one man who can rally the people. Claims to be a reborn Ajax the Lesser. Find him and get him back. So, where's the blacksmith? The forge caught fire. The smith's in the village, but you'll need to help him rebuild before he can work again. Tell me more about the horse breeder. She knows horses better than Poseidon. Get her to put a mare under each of these villagers, and we'll have a chance. If dead heroes are anything like me, they don't like being impersonated. Are you sure this Ajax guy is a good idea? Let the dead judge us all they want. We need to shake the fear out of these villagers. The last time I saw Ajax, he was headed to the hills southwest of here, on the northern border of Fokis. Tell me what you know about the one using my name. He came in with a vicious little bird. Called it... Icarus? Something like that. Anyway, said he'd help, then made things worse at every turn. So far, you two have a lot in common. The villagers will be warriors when I'm done. Are you the blacksmith? I was. Then another Mistyos, an eagle something, came to help. Kind young man. It's Eagle Bearer. And uh, there's only one. Me. Ah, the one who sunk the reinforcements. Gossip travels fast. Let's talk about the other Mistyos. Eagle something. The poor boy lit my forge, but somehow caused the fire to erupt. Flames everywhere. 
I can barely see now, or move my hands. But you're the only smith in town, and pirates are coming. We need you to start making weapons. No need to worry. Old Kalipidis has a few good blades left in him. I just need some space to work. Those stone blocks would make a fine table. Could you move them for me? Sounds easy enough. Crush someone with these things if you're not careful. Excellent work. Well, what next? I suppose we can't make weapons without iron now, can we? I have more than enough to share. You have some of mine. Well, this is certainly better than when that other Mystios came to help. All a good smith needs now are his tools. Your tools? Really? The Eagle something said they were stolen by a small group of bad eggs. They rode west of here, but I'm not sure where. I'll get them. Then you'll be ready to work? Of course. You've been so kind to this old smith. I thought I'd never work again. But your generosity has changed all that. They'll be watching for me. I need to be careful. Standard slip in our line of work, right? You read my mind.
I've got your tools right here. Ah, what a day. You should be proud. You've given this old man purpose again. Now, if you could just set those aside for a moment, I'll get started. Calipidis? Gods. I've seen a lot in my life, but that was brutal. Poor Calipi. 